Yo! Ladies and gentlemen, what is up, you guys? Welcome to the stream. Hope everything looks and sounds okay. It seems to be look working a little bit weird. Um, I don't know. Well, welcome to the stream! What is up? Top May Jet Warrior Princess Stack! Sounds fine. Yeah, but it's super sensitive. Let me um give you an example. I'm just gonna throw something. Here's a box. I'll throw it at my wall. And you guys could probably hear that like crystal clear, which I don't really like. That means if if you couldn't hear that, then that's good. If you could hear that, then that means you're gonna be able to hear all kinds of background noise, which would be really annoying. It sounds right, at least. Okay, well that's good. That's a step in the right. What's up, Triple J? Vash and rain armor well and Stephanie, thank you for the host yeah you guys did hear that that's exactly what i thought when i stream normally you guys can't hear that stuff and i don't know what in on earth is going on anyway we're gonna play glad you were here nice and early with your code ready rain armor but we're gonna play um we're gonna play levels based on a raffle system so whoever wins the raffle will play their level first so I don't know if you have that set up you can run it now tell me but very first thing I wanted to show you a couple things that I was messing around with this morning kind of cool stuff not the coolest but kind of cool anyway um, tell me if you guys can end up hearing this gamepad volume if you can hear that too that would be really annoying but yeah it's pretty bad so anyway this is something kind of cool i was messing around with you can geez, if you're good see you want to do the raffle now yeah yeah anyone who wants to have their level played let's raffle it off now the reason i wanted to do a raffle instead of a list is so that like i don't know it's more fair so that way if people just came in towards the end of the stream that they still have a chance but anyway this is what I was messing around with this morning. You can just, like, bounce on these bombs all day if you're a pro. It's super cool. Like, look at this. I can just chill here all day. I don't know. It seems really fun. You can't hear the gamepad. Okay, awesome, awesome, awesome. Thank you for letting me know, Stack. So anyone who wants to have their level be played, we'll do a raffle every some number of minutes. Anyway, after like a minute, you can close the raffle, we'll pick a winner, and then we'll play whoever's levels, whoever wants their level to be played. And if no one enters, then that means whoever was, um, whoever had the initiative to enter will have their level played. Pretty neat idea. Yeah. What the clicking noise was. Wait a minute, what clicking noise? Can you hear the clicking noise? I hope you guys can't hear anything. Maybe I can just hold it further away if you can. But anyway, whatever. I hope you guys had an awesome weekend. Happy Monday. Rain armor leaves already? I don't know. Possibly. Quite likely. Did you make levels yet, Stack? We can play your levels. Well, anyway. It looks like... Vash was the only one who entered. So then we'll just play Vash's levels first, I guess. A clicking noise meaning a sound of clicking. Oh, well, I didn't click anything. I don't know. Maybe it was something random in the background. Who knows? It's a mystery. You should not get your laptop fixed. Get a new one altogether. Vash is our only. Yes, he is. So that makes it easy. We'll just play Vash's levels. Did you play the level you made for Jesse? Yes. No. I played one of your levels, the one that I beat. What do you think is the best level? German Mage! What's up, German Mage? Dude! I think you have amazing levels. We'll have like a special time set aside for playing Jammin' Mage's levels. Jammin' Mage's levels, like I don't really like to pick favorites, but man, he puts a lot of effort into those things, you guys. 
It's really cool. Oh, cool. You're naming levels after people. Jesse, Dark Shadows, Morials. Oh, so that's named after Geo. And then D, Mr. Bones Wild Ride. Jesse's level was really easy for Daikon. Okay, well then let's see if it's really easy for me. Um, what is fresh? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, indeed. Indeed. Um, wrecked. Oh, dang it. I got wrecked. But anyway, if, um, if not that many people are interested in raffling, then we can just play everyone's levels, and that would be way better. But the other day, we had the problem of, like, thousands of people wanting all the levels to be played, and it was taking forever. Wrecked. Oh, man. Why did you put booze right at the start? Oh, this is easy. Cool, we can just climb above them. I like that. I like that a lot. This level. Yes, this level. Don't do that. Mr. Bones is a troll level. Why would you make a troll level? I am making, I am working on a... All right, please let me up. You guys, come on. We've got some teamwork to do here. We gotta work really hard to teamwork this out. There we go. One, two, three. Oh gosh, I guess I can just walk under them. I took so long they got into a good position for me. How on earth do you do this though? I guess you have to ride the wave. Ride the little bullets. Um, because of the joke behind it. What's the joke behind it? Probably an inside joke that's only funny if you were there at the time. You wish you were more creative. Oh, well, <laughs> I can come up with ideas for you, Stack. If you want to steal my ideas, go for it. I have made a somewhat easy level, mainly because I wanted people... Yeah, I bet you're... I killed myself because I wasn't trying to! It totally was not intentional. There we go. Yes! I want Earth to land on that. It's an internet meme. Frappuccino! What's up, Frappuccino? Welcome to the street. Oh, dang it. Dang it. Mr. Bones Wild Ride. Yeah, that reminds me of Sam Boney. He had a bot in his channel called Marrowbot. I always told him to call it Bonebot because I thought that would be way cooler. But he always said, no, we're not calling it Bonebot. And it took me a while to realize, oh, Marrow is in Bone Marrow. But who would think of that? Does marrow only come up in that one word of, oh jeez, of bone marrow? Like, are there other types of marrow out there? I guess there's marrowac. Dang it, how am I ever gonna land there? All right, let's check out your other level. This start is like way too hard. You know what, am I? <laughs> you are no longer young because you're older than I am. Old woman dummy. What other levels do you like? You were just watching someone try 100 Mario Challenge. Expert mode. Yeah, I haven't even touched expert mode. I've only done easy and norm. Are you kidding me? Easy and normal. Okay. There we go. Alright, all right, let's run. Dang it. We're dead already. Humans would. This level is hard. What do you want in your level? Oh, cool. Are there any? Yes! All right. Oh, that level wasn't that hard. That was easy. <laughs> okay, we beat it. That, um, that was not that hard, Vash. I think we've done pretty well, actually. I think we found the dev path. So good job, us. I'll give you a star, man, but don't do that. <laughs> I'm bad in Mario too, but that doesn't mean I would put dev paths in. My I don't know. I think I un I understand what you're doing though. I totally understand. Nice secret. Yeah, easily found. Okay, Ethiopia. Here we go. Oh jeez. All right, let's eek on out of here. Dang it. We can't get out. I don't know how to do this. Can we find another their dev pad? Are there secrets just sitting here? Yeah! <laughs> oh man! I think we're gonna beat another level. 
There we go. You need to get stuff done. AFK. Okay. You're gonna be AFK? Sounds fine. You have to not get the mushroom. Okay. I see. Alright, well, let's try that again. I like finding secrets. <laughs> They're so much fun. When someone comes in, whining and shouting. The Yo, Jesse! What is up, man? Welcome and thank you for the host, dude! Jesse, I will take on your level. Oh, jeez. After I finish messing around with one of Vash's. I guess. Dang it, so you have to not get the mushroom. Okay. Epic ZX, what's up, dude? How do you not get the mushroom? This is impossible. It spawns like right on top of. It literally starts inside of you. I don't know how to do this without taking the death path, man. That is that is a real mystery. Okay, well we we beat two of Vash's levels. You said this one was a troll ride? Okay, let's take on this one. You think you did this one wrong. Mr. Bones Wild Wait, oh, Wild Ride. Okay. Oh dang it! You delete it and remake it. Okay. Sounds good. <laughs> Sounds good, Vash. Um, anyway, there have been some levels you guys that I've found I saw YouTube videos of them where they're meant to be like emotional experiences. One of them starts out, and it just, it's filled out all link points, kind of like this level where it says Mr. Bones Wild Ride, except instead of saying that, it says, how far would you go to save your son? And apparently it's a, it's a parody of some other game. And then, like, you have to kill Yoshi to try and save your son, and then you kill a Goomba and this other stuff, and then it said, that was my wife. It's like this really depressing level. And then you go to jail in the end. It's pretty interesting when people try and incorporate narratives into their stories or into their levels. There's another one called Waluigi's Pitiful Existence. Where it just tells you how miserable Waluigi is. And you have to become Mario to beat the level. Jeez! That level made the news. It made the news?! That's crazy. So people had like really, really different reactions to it. Some people saw it and they were like, whoa, that is really dark. And then other people saw it as a parody of Heavy Rain. I guess you have to stand here and wait. Well then, wait, we shall. Okay, here we go. This isn't very wild. It's very slow and peaceful. I really don't mind this ride. Very gentle. Lots of fireballs. The problem with fireballs is if you push them really high up like that, they come up so fast. That it's like impossible to dodge them. If you put them really slow, when they get to the peak of their jump, that's when they slow down a lot more. So then it becomes easier to dodge them. I'm just gonna tank the damage. I mean, okay. Whoa, I guess we shouldn't tank the damage. And everyone's laughing at me. Why is everyone laughing at me? It's your level. Alright, I'm pretty sure I'm already following you. Oh, dang it. Okay, let's take on um let's take on some of Jesse's levels. I will come back to your levels, Vash. I definitely will. There's a small delay on the audio video. Is the audio behind the video? There's supposed to be a delay. Because there's a delay on the capture card. I think. You have several new ones. Okay. Sounds good. Let's take on Jesse's course first. Cause I think he has, did you make new ones, Jesse? I know you have at least one. There we go. Jesse's levels are always fair and design perilous piece of expanding. Okay, this is the one I can take on. I've, um, I haven't beaten it, but I've, I saw Daikon play it and I messed around with it a little bit. So I think this level is totally beatable. It starts out and like throws a complete all sorts of madness at you. But it's pretty easy. You just get up on here, you grab your P-switch. Supposedly everyone oh dang it. 
Everyone who plays this level takes it on differently. So we'll see. Designed to cause random upsets. Just make sure it's fair. I guess the most important thing is make sure it's fun. Invisible blocks are not fun for anyone. Even people who like Kaizo level, um, Kaizo difficult levels are like, this is not entertaining when you get hit by an invisible block. I don't remember how I do this, but... Oh, jeez. Whatever. It works! Yes. Okay, so now we're gonna get through with our helmet. There we go. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Alright. No! We're gonna mess up the sequence! We wasted too much time. And everything falls to pieces. You've got auto audio delay. I don't know what that means. Does that mean the audio is behind? Is the audio being delayed too much? Or not enough? I don't know. So I know the, I have an audio delay set to 700 milliseconds, I think. It should be set to that. I don't know if I need to delay it more or less compared to the video. You didn't split cell to show me a secret. Oh, I I played this level well. Dai was playing it all happened up all at the same time. Wait a minute. I know how I can do this to be way more efficient on time. Oh jeez. I'm gonna lose everything this way! Audio is behind the video, so it's being delayed too much, really? Does anyone know, if I change that while I'm still streaming, will it work? Or do I have to turn off the stream and start it all over again? Let's turn that down. Wait a minute, audio is behind? This is the same one I tried last time. Yeah, I don't know you guys, it's a real mystery. Dang it. Sorry, this software is really hard to use. Let's try changing these values. I thought I had it set perfectly, but apparently not. Zero, zero. Well, I have no idea. I'm just gonna see if I can set everything back to zero. I had it set perfectly last time I streamed this game, but I don't know why it's all messed up. Are you outporting sound to desktop? No, I don't think so, but I know my capture card has a 700 second millisecond delay, so I don't know what I have to delay. Do I have to delay my video? Do I have to delay the capture card? Or do I have to delay my mic? I don't know. I know I had it perfect the other day, so I don't know why it all changed. Is this the same one? I also don't know. If I can change it while I'm still streaming, or if I have to reset or not. Wait, you haven't seen the Shelmet secret? You never knew that you could do that? I don't know the point of this, because I know it. you can ride on that shell off into oblivion. Alright, there we go. But, um... There we go. So, is it still delayed, you guys? For those of you who understand that lingo? I set the delay down to zero, but I'm pretty sure that's still going to be off, so I think I need to turn it up. Delay is behind. So I don't- now there's no delay at all. Is that good or bad? I set it down to zero. There we go. Now the trick is- yes. You have to bring one of the P-switches with you and keep the other one. Harder and more improved! Okay, and now this is where it gets really tricky. See that shell over there? Oh jeez! You have to land like way over there. That's amazing. What's amazing? I did something amazing? Well, that's a good thing to hear. That is very good. We can totally beat this level though. It's like an easy level. It's so completely beatable. Alright, there we go. We got our mushroom. 
Kerr, what's up, Kerr? How are you doing, Kerr? Oh, dang it. There's just so many places where you can make mistakes that there's no delay. I don't know what that means, but okay. I, d I really don't understand the technical words that they use. All right, there we go. We're doing okay. Now we get, we suit up. It's nice. I have like my procedure for this level for what I'm gonna do. It's all part of a pattern. It's not how perfect can you play. There's a lot of areas where you can make mistakes. Like right here. But if you play really well, you'll make no mistakes and then you'll be awesome. So that, oh geez. So you take one of the switches with you. Oh my gosh, no! We're gonna die. Are you kidding me? That freaking ground pound wrecked me so hard. That means it's working. Okay, awesome! Well, that's good. That is good to hear. It's so, so... Okay, you've got like a decision tree through this level. The first thing you can try and do is try and get past those spikes. The first set of spikes without using your helmet. Which is possible, it's just difficult. If you lose it, it's not a big deal. You'll get a new one later on in the level, which is like perfectly fine. There's no reason not to suit up here. Now this part is a little tough. You can either make the thwomp crush it. Aw oh, dang it. This is terrible. This is horrendous! That's reset worthy. Or you can try and land on it yourself. So there's a lot of different ways to beat this level. Yeah, the ground pound is the worst! It trolls you so hard. And then when you get into the room with the two P-switches... So I try and bring a P-switch with me out of those two, which means not pushing one and then just picking up the other one. Oh, geez. What am I even doing with my life? Alright, there we go. I don't know what happened to my cannons. There's supposed to be cannons over here. Oh, there they are. They despawned. Did you guys see that? They were gone and then they reappeared. That's insane. Alright, let's push the switch. There we go. Now we can almost get through without getting wrecked. Okay. Anyway, we're fine. We're still fine. So you push one. There we go. Okay, they're out of my way. We took a switch with us. That's exactly what I wanted to do this whole time. We'll put on a helmet here. There we go. Like so. We'll get suited up like this. Now this part is a little tricky because there's one thing that... No, wait a minute. There's a secret. We found a secret! This is totally doable. As long as we can run fast enough. I'm gonna run out of time, aren't I? Are you kidding me? How do I get this? Wait a minute, this is stupid! There's no way through! Why would you do that? Okay, I don't understand that. Do you have to bring like a third piece? Wait, I don't know how to beat this. I thought I knew how to beat this. Well, this is a real mystery. Um. Okay. Well, that stage is pretty tough then. I literally don't know how to beat that then. I know you bring one with you, but you have to use it to take this. Oh, I bet you have to go underneath and I thought wrong. Oh man. No, your level's not stupid. I take that back. Just very, very, very agonizing. Anyway, we can take on Jam and Mage's levels next, but we'll come back to your levels. We'll come back to everyone's levels. Do the bomb bombs and flames? Is that a really hard level? That has a pretty hard sounding name. Mushroom Gorge. That sounds friendly. Or, um, you know what? I've been doing them in order. I did one, two, one, three, one, one. Let's do one, four. Infested Fortress. You can't beat it. You can! If you go, I think there's another way. You have to go underneath. I think that whole path that I took is a troll path. I don't think there's a way to beat it that way. I think it's all there just to mess with you. Oh, jeez. You can totally beat it if you give the boss another shot. Why, does one of those cannons shoot a P-switch or something? 
There's just so many enemies at the So many enemies at the end. I got ahead of myself. Yeah, I did. I was not thinking straight. Not at oh, dang it. The worst part is I've played that level before and I've seen people play it. I know that you can use the spiky helmet to to kill those guys at the end. Um, yeah, this is Jammin's mate. Jammin made just stage. The little ghost you can wreck. There we go. Yeah. Okay. Beautiful coins. Such fantastic little things to pick up. They don't really mean anything. In fact, they're like completely worthless since we don't have lives. But they make a nice little sound. I saw him when he was designing this level, and geez, a lot of people died there. He was talking about making a lot of stuff that looks scary, but it's not really going to hurt you. You can see that with all the piranha plants at the top. I guess that with the fireballs, they could technically hurt you, but it's such a slow area that, like, the hazards aren't... Oh, dang. Okay, that one's obnoxious, but a lot of them, you kind of have to go out of your way to get hurt by them. Like, they're, they're, they're still hazards. They're definitely hazards. But they're easy to deal with as long as you're paying attention. Like, with these donut blocks, even if I stand here and wait around, it's gonna fall, but then you can still jump out of it. Oh, jeez, why? Why am I not paying attention? You don't have to go through another path. There's multiple ways and multiple options. Got it. Little guy. Yeah, they're trapped. They're just scenery. The poor little creatures. So he said a little coin pet. Oh, jeez, I jumped too high? Suspicious. <laughs> oh, man. There we go. Alright, we got our mushroom. So one thing I really like is putting power-ups right at the beginning of the level. You're a bit ahead of the game. Wait, so there's not enough delay? Oh, jeez. I'm spoiling everything. That's what I was afraid of. But Epic ZX said it was okay. One, two. Do I need to add more delay to the um, audio thing? They're in the world. They're in the dang world. What is that movie from? I think it's from Alien. No, maybe Tremors. I know it's a movie reference. That's my gamepad. My gamepad is wait. What do you mean? Can you hear the gamepad? Oh, jeez. Leave it be. No, that sounds terrible, though. If everything's not perfect, then that's horrible. Alright, there we go. If you can hear the gamepad, let me know. Or if you can hear anything. If anything sounds imperfect. What's up, DSJ? How you doing, man? Welcome to the hard street. Why? Every single time. You're not appearing. You know what, speaking of appearing, there's not even a single light on in my room. Now there is, we've got all of one light on. That's good. Yeah, are you feeling better, DSJ? Okay, we gotta wait for them to disappear. One, why? Maybe we can, you can't spin jump in this game, which is a real shame. I would love to be able to spin jump here. Okay. Gamepad can be heard. Oh, really? Dang it! Why? Do we have any audio experts in the stream who can just explain? Why is my mic so sensitive? Why does it hear my gamepad? Okay, one, two, three. When it wouldn't hear it, on regular OBS, it didn't hear it. I'm talking about my voice. I don't want it to mess up for you guys. There we go. Come on. There we go. Okay. We're safe. So the voice is all not delayed enough. Dang. Well, we used our iframes to get through it. Whatever you were doing to it last night. You think so? 
I didn't really change anything I changed, I should have put back to normal. Does anyone know how to make a microphone less sensitive to outside noise? Maybe it's because I drop my mic so much. I drop it like a million times. But OBS is supposed to like drown out background noise, isn't it? That's how normal OBS works at least. What? There we go. Is um is Vash still here? Vash knows audio stuff! Oh, Alright, there we go. We're safe. Did I uninstall that weird thing? No, I didn't. Um, but I don't think, I don't even have that program turned on. I downloaded some program that was supposed to help disable background noise. Because here's the thing, you guys. My, um, my mic is way more sensitive on Skype than it is when I'm streaming. But now it's being really sensitive while streaming, too. So that's, like, not good. Not good at all. It's not uninstalled, but it's not running either. So I don't know. This is a real mystery. Oh well, it should hopefully be okay. I don't know, you guys. It's a real mystery. You definitely think it's the poor treatment of my stuff. Well, I don't treat it poorly on purpose. It just falls and breaks. The cord is so short. They should not make devices with short cords. And not like making a long... Okay, I guess maybe it is my fault because I realize even with things that have really long cords, then the cord is so long that I trip over it anyway. Maybe I should get a new mic. Get a proper desk. What's up, you child judge? Yes, yeah, so blame the schools. Let's just blame them for everything. There we go. Perfect. I actually jumped properly. How you doing, you child judge? How's your day, man? There we go. Oh, man. Dang it, why? The mushroom get meshed with all the things down there. That's scary. Dang it. I don't know how to beat this level. I remember... When I played Jam and Mage's other levels, they were pretty easy. Did you do it? Okay, we're getting somewhere. No more dollhouse furniture. Yeah, totally. You were right. We need to get real furniture, but that costs real money. It's such a hazard. I always forget to look upward. Why are all the terrifying things upward? Okay, we're alive. You want a Coke? Okay, go get yourself some soda. That sounds cool. I need to go get myself some water. I always forget to drink water. Okay, I think we can stand here and be okay. Are you kidding me? Why? It's not safe. There's a mushroom there. All right. I want to be safe near the mushroom. That's all I really want from my life. Okay, as long as you're patient. There we go. We're good. We're good. Tired. Afraid to sleep. Because your clock won't wake you up in time. Why won't your clock wake you up? Is it not going to be loud enough? Are you going to sleep through your alarm? That would be terrible. That's only happened to me once in my life. And I couldn't believe it. It was actually like a week. Are you kidding me? The one fireball. <laughs> oh man, I hate fireballs. Like, right here, they're okay. I can see them coming. They're very predictable. And it's like, oh, there's a fireball. But when you don't see them coming, or when they go really, really high, the higher they go, the faster they go. From, breaking, from not breaking all my dishes and all my mics. Yeah. That's true. That's a good point. I keep breaking dishes by mistake. Because... Here's what Kurt's referring to. I keep like, I set the dish down and then my furniture is so small that things happen and it jiggles and then... 
the more that a glass jiggles on a table, the closer it's gonna eat towards the edge. Like, why does it have to be that way? Why can't it just like jiggle towards the center of my table? But apparently that's not how physics works or something. Or I'm just unlucky. Or maybe it does move towards the center, and then I just don't remember those instances because I put the glass away safely. But I've broken at least like four cups and dishes this way by them falling off eventually, slowly moving towards the edge. You can save money on lamps too. Yeah, I should be able to save money on lamps. It's really odd. It does, and it backlogs your snooze, your snooze button count. So it's used to used to hitting the snooze three times. Oh yeah, okay, I can understand that. It was just the weirdest thing that one time when I just straight up slept through my alarm. It's like why? What's the point? Since then I've put on much, much more obnoxious alarms. So that it starts out and there's a peaceful one. And then there's a much more terrifying one that happens over time. We might make a real level today. Okay, a non-troll level? That sounds like a good idea, Vash. Okay, Vash, now that you're here, do you have any tips or ideas? I mentioned this earlier, I don't know if you know, but why is my mic so sensitive all of a sudden? How do I make my... Is there like a program where I can make my mic... Yes, we did it! We actually beat it! Make my mic less sensitive so that it hears my voice but it doesn't hear all the background noise. Because it didn't do that last week. Too easy. No, they're good. Easy stages are fun stages. They're really fun. And welcome to the stream, Kenan! Welcome. What's up, dude? Um. Where does John know this? Maybe you need more giant hammer bros as opposed to regular giant hammer bros. Okay. Go to the recording devices, drop off some of the game. All right, let's try that out. Let's see what happens. Hopefully this works. Um, because it was totally working perfectly fine last week. Property. I don't know if I see the game. Where do I find that? Well, anyway, we beat one of Jam and Mage's levels today. Sorry, you've been lurking for a while. Okay. Well, welcome. In control panel. Control panel. Yeah, wait, control panel. Let me see if I can find this. And then... View devices? One second, you guys. We can put on the nice, pleasant music of Mario while I try and figure this out. Blue snowball. Hardware? Property? I don't know if I can find this. Right click the sound. Yeah, I can find that. Recording devices, okay. Yeah, it doesn't list anything there though. I see advanced levels listing in general. What kind of clock is this? Yeah, why don't you get a, a, um, a much, much louder, much more obnoxious clock? I think that's what you're gonna need. I don't see this guy. Goomba gets the double. Yeah, the Goomba's wrecking me. <laughs> no. We, uh, we barely got that. Could it be because my other mic is... If I can disable that. Okay. The only other thing I can think of is maybe my other mic was Blue Snowball should be on the list. Yeah, I found it, but I can't find anything that says gain on it. Too 
up and there's a full moon. Really? Wait, why? That sounds obnoxious. You want to just randomly get up when there's a full moon? Okay, there we go. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Okay, we can play your level next, Kingdom, if you want. And then... I think... Wow, that's cool! This is really cool! Look, they have a little train. A Goomba train. Whoa, okay. Now their train is bo broken. Ooh, a fireflower. Man, this level should be easy. I really like easy levels. There we go. Even though I make hard levels, I would show you guys my levels, but I would rather see you guys play them for the first time. Why? Maybe I was wrong. I think I was wrong. There's Hammer Bros here, and Hammer Bros are never an easy level. Why? Why do you make your alarm clock so complicated? There we go. Oh, this is cool. So they're mushroom platforms, but he replaced the mushroom with, like, regular blocks. Gosh, I hate music note blocks. They are the worst. If you want to make people rage, just make your entire level music note block. So you said it. Oh, cool. Oh, are you kidding me? I thought that was safe. Why is nothing safe in this world? What are they called? I know they're not actually called saw blades. In the actual game, they're called like grinders or something. I think it's grinders. There we go. Okay. Yes, another. I was afraid it was going to be a mushroom. Because, of course, mushrooms just like roll around the world. If it rolls around in this factory, I'm gonna end up dead. Bash, I cannot find that thing that you were talking about. I found the devices, but there was nothing that said anything about me on there. Oh, let's look. Oh. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Kurt. That is what you should make if you want everyone. Can we just wait till Kamek turns one of these blocks into a fire flower? I've heard people talking about how terrible Kamek will do things to her. Like, you're about to beat leave the level, and then it turns it into like some horrible enemy! Oh, are you kidding me? Right at the end? You should have had... Yeah, it did have my list of mics. Keenan, if you're still here, say something. And then as soon as we get this, um, this mic issue figured out, we'll play your level. Yeah, I see microphone, recording, microphone, blue snowball. Oh, wait a minute. Is it picking up my other mic? Let's wiggle that. You wish you had the game. You should get it. You should totally get it. Um, hit properties. Okay, got it. Properties. Maybe it's because I have my, another mic plugged in. That's the only other thing I can think of. Sorry about the technical difficulties, you guys. Okay, but in properties, I still don't see game. You've had a yellow snow- Oh, don't eat a yellow snowball! That's one thing I would suggest. Let me unplug this, you guys. Okay, can you still hear background noise? You shouldn't eat that. Yeah, exactly. It wasn't lemon. Dang it. Tell me if you can still hear the background noise. There, if you can, you can hear an echo. Or I can throw something else out of the wall. So that way you would be able to tell if there's um some kind of... Tell me if you can hear this. Hopefully not. I had like four different mics plugged in. What's up, Carol? Z, 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 Z. What is up, Carols? And hello, Tasso. You've had a meeting with your roommates. About what? About how one guy's in the kitchen all the time and he just camps out there and hangs out like he has a grand old Yeah, but anyway, Vash, I hit properties and I see. I see general, listen, levels in advance, and then there's another properties which says general, driver, and details. And I have no idea where to go from there. Did you go over the rules? Yeah, make all the rules, man. Make just all sorts of rules. Make all kinds of rules. Tell them 
that you, no one's allowed to camp out in the kitchen. Cause like I said, I had my own roommate who did that. It's like, why? Why are you always here? I think it's, oh, dang it, I hate invisible blocks so much. Even if they're in ghost houses, I just can't stand them. Because as soon as you have one invisible block in your level, then you're gonna make people think, okay, there could be invisible blocks anywhere. Are they here? Are they anywhere? Then you're just gonna leave your player on like a wild goose chase trying to find every single invisible block in the entire world. And that's just depressing. It's a horrible existence to live. Did you make any new levels, Chasa? Where are you? Do I even follow you? I should. I think I played your level before I knew I could follow people. I don't think I actually follow you. Okay, let me go follow you. There we go. People who have cleared it. It would be... There you are. First, semi-hard. <laughs> That's what you call it, semi-hard? I've never played this stage. What's this one? Can you see a screenshot of it? Oh yeah, I should be able to um, do that. Or maybe I can just add a window capture of what I see. Or maybe a desktop capture. Add. I don't even know how to add desktop captures. Whoa, can you guys see this? You probably can. I see this window. There's other windows. There's all sorts of windows, man. Microphone properties. There's this window. I don't know what you wanted to see, but we're trying to figure something out. What's up, Red Mess? How you doing, dude? Welcome to the stream! Go to general. Okay. We're at general. You should share your soda with your roommates because if you share your soda with them now, then go to properties. Okay, we're trying to figure out a mic issue. But there's nothing in properties. Blue snowball properties. There. But there's nothing useful here, I assure you. You're okay. You're doing okay? Well, I'm glad to hear it. I'm doing great. Dude, I am in love with Mario Maker. This game is so great. We're just trying to figure out this audio issue. Use the oven after six. Wait, what? Why would you make that a rule? What's the problem with using the oven at night? Just to make their life more insane? Play your level? Yeah, we will play your level. As soon as we get this figured out. But I hope you guys are all doing really, really well. Good afternoon. I don't think there's anything here. Hit properties. Change settings. Driver. See, there's like nothing useful. And even if I hit change settings, that doesn't bring up anything useful either. It's like a whole mystery. I need to find like some third party program. It has no. Something is wrong. Really? It's broken? Okay, well, let's get rid of this. Remove that. Not you too. Oh no. Um, tell me if you can hear an echo of the game sound or not. I had like alternative mics. Sometimes it picks up the mic of my webcam, and I think I disabled that. So hopefully, if that was picking up anything, it should be okay now. Honey, lemon. How many people are gonna? Oh man, why is everyone falling sick? That is not good. That is not good at all. Oh jeez. Okay, thank goodness you kept it safe. For a blind jump. Blind jumps are terrifying. Do not put blind jumps in your level. Tell you it's your favorite. Yeah, always do favors for people because you might need a favor yourself in the future someday. There we go. So this is Tasso's level. I'm kind of just playing levels at random. Dang it. Dang it. Dang it. Wavering mind game. 
Jump on this. <laughs> okay. Yeah, let's all jump on this. Wait a minute. If we all jump on the six subway together, then we're all gonna get sick together, and that sounds terrible. That does not sound like a. Dang it. So far. It's a fair. It's a fair jump, so it can be a blind jump. I don't know if I agree. Okay. I don't think blind jumps are ever a good idea. Unless you have a trail of coins for them to go through. Right. Leap of faith are always terrifying. But the earlier in the level it- Are you kidding me? Why? Ugh, why do you put those trolls in the level? Well, that's good. 300 different viruses. Cold is also caused if you're 3,000 feet above the sea. Oh, you do? I know some friend. I have a friend. His name is Fushli. He has all sorts of medical problems. I feel really bad for him because it's like, man, why are you so unlucky? Why does all this terrible stuff happen to you when I'm... See, that is not fair. You have to be like full speed. Cold is the only sickness you ever had. Yeah, I barely ever get sick. And that's one of the nice things about being me. So if anyone ever wants to be me, that's one of the perks you'll get. Almost never getting sick. Oh, man. Why? Why did you put that there? Why can't we have more platforms? Mike might be messed up. Really? Do you think it's... No, it totally wasn't this sensitive last time. Should I just buy a new mic? Maybe I should buy a new mic. I really like this snowball, though. I think it's an OBS setting. It's some kind of problem with OBS. There we go. Because it used to always not pick up background sound in the past. And now it's starting to pick up background sound again. But it would always pick up background sound in Skype, just not in OBS. I'm sure there's some kind of third party program to fix it. Keep your momentum. So stop. I'm not gossiping, I'm just sharing public information. There we go. Rick! Yes! There are some points where you just can't keep your momentum. I actually really like this level. This is pretty fun. It's nice, say, if there's no, like, there's no obnoxious thing besides the blind jumps. There's no note blocks. There's no springs. There's no invisible blocks. There's not too many enemies. No, no one should suffocate. It should have a levels tab. There is a levels tab. I'm almost certain there's a levels tab. That's where we put all our levels at. Yeah. There is a levels. But under my levels tab, it only says microphone. A hundred. There's no other options down there. I just need to, like, change the sensitivity of it. No springs or no no, no, that's how you build a good level. Rule one in building a good level. No springs and no no blocks. Not burning the people around. Loophole. Yeah, loophole's been fun. Try lowering the level. Wait a minute, are you serious? Isn't that just making me quieter? it to like 70. I don't think that helps. I think that just makes my voice quieter. Isn't that volume? Just get good. Yeah, too low. I don't... Does that actually affect the sensitivity of it? Or is it just like loudness? Dingle Dots! What's up, Dingle Dots? How are you doing, man? Welcome to the stream! Deconstruct mainframe. Why would you deconstruct mainframe? That sounds like a bad idea. You're gonna get nanobots inside your system, you Judge. 
Add <laughs> lots of salt. Yeah, lots and lots of salt. This is not cooking. You can add as much salt as you want, and it will not ruin your recipe. It's almost pretty hard. But I like it. I really don't mind it. Dang it. Um, we can play your level next, Batman. After another handful of attempts here, I really like this level though. It's a fun level! Okay, one, two, there we go. Three, four, okay. five, six, seven, eight. Alright, we will be here. One, two, okay, we're good, we're good. Yes! Oh man. I need to take a breather. This is another thing about level design. When you have really, really hard jump- Oh, why?! I was gonna jump and then I saw the evil pop out. Concentrated evil has been popped into that pipe. And I hesitated, I got scared. Why would you put evil inside of a pipe? We need a break from all this tension. <laughs> You're a walking corpse? Well then... We're, I'm gonna get my zombie hunting army on you. I'm gonna prevent this apocalypse! Are you kidding me? Why is that so hard? Help. I did push the jump button, but I tried to slow down. I wanted to second guess it. I didn't believe. There we go. Why? I feel like we're doing this almost perfectly. It's almost so close to frame perfect. Maybe I should, maybe I should just wait off until I'm like falling off the ledge. I can show you guys the level I made. I made a level where it started out pretty easy, hard. What's up, Lucky Gamer? Welcome to the stream, Lucky Gamer. Oh dang it! How are you doing, man? How is everyone doing? So I know a lot of people have asked you this, Dingle Dot, but man, when are you gonna get the game? It is that hard. I know you know it's this hard because it's one. Wait, it does change how much the mic picks up. So if I turn that down, and then I just turn my my volume up, then it won't pick up as much game volume. Are you sure? Turning it off and turning it back on again. Yes, I have. I don't know, I'm gonna have to play with that. If you guys hear, I have the, my gamepad. My gamepad is like inches away from my mic. So if you end up hearing gamepad volume, let me know. Okay. Let me know, or if my mic gets too low, also let me know. Oh, dude, Shadow of the Hedgehog looks awesome! I actually want to play it myself. I know people say it's a terrible game. Is it actually terrible, or is it actually a really good game? What's up, Fish Wobbles? Thank you for the host. Thank you so much. And welcome to the stream. Okay. Dang it. Why? 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 Okay. One. Welcome to the stream, Razna! What's going on, man? Aw, oh, dang it. Shadow the Hedgehog is cancer. Really? What's up, Alex? Welcome! One, two. It's really cancer? I thought it looked fun. Have you played it? Or is this all just more your say? Thank goodness. You guys want to know something? My favorite kinds of jumps. You're here for about 10 minutes. Then leave for a bit. Okay, then you'll be back. Okay, we can play your level when you get back. Um, I said I'd play Ratmus's level. If you're still here, Ratmus, we'll do your level. It's cancer. It's not cancer. It looks fun. It looks really fun. I'll show you guys my level really, really quick. This is the kind of jump I really like. A backwards jump. Where you're sitting right here. You're like, oh, man, I really... If you play my levels, please do not do this. 
don't put a comment in the level itself. Just if I sit here and I hit comment right now, it's gonna put a comment right here, which is like, why? <laughs> Get out of here! It makes me want to re-upload the level. But anyway, in the, this room, I feel like this. The, I'll just show you the first room because people struggle a lot with this. It's made in a way where you fall and then you can try it again. I can't believe how much trouble people have with this, but I've watched multiple people play it and they struggle with it a lot. So this first jump is really easy. Obviously you're supposed to get down below, so then you're like, oh no, I can't do it. Well, it's like, okay, that's actually really easy to do. All you have to do is just like, just um, use your momentum, fall backwards. It's like your sheet, you fall backwards. That's, that's all part of the theme. And then you get on this platform and then be like, oh no, I can't get across. Don't show them how to do it, too late. I think this is super easy. This is ridiculously easy. But apparently it's not easy. Created trial in there. I just really like this first jump. I like backwards jumps. Um, when I make my own levels, I'm gonna make like really, really, you're, that's a good point. I really shouldn't spoil my own levels. But they're so cool. After people play them, I'll, I'll just, spoil everything yeah she she gets amazing i have one level that i really want to spoil for everyone but it's a puzzle level so it has all these really really hard puzzles in it create a trial and error it's not trial and error it's just like okay you're not good enough to make this jump well we'll give you another shot Oh, yeah, definitely. I tried playing... You hate chatting on the phone. I'm sorry, lucky gamer. I know it takes forever when you're like, Ugh, phone messages? Why do you take so long to punch in? Um, it may be easy for others. Yeah, for you, you said the level was, like, ridiculously easy. I feel like the level is medium difficulty. It might take an average player, like, half an hour to beat. But it's not hard. That's, it's the sole basis. It is! And if I made that where you die instantly when you try it, then it would have been a whole lot more unforgiving. Um, anyway, who else has a level that wants to be played? I was gonna play Ratmus's level, but I don't think he's here right now. So we'll wait till he's back. Half an hour. Yeah, I know you could beat it on like your first try. Skype was down for me too! I have no idea what on earth is going on. Puzzle might take oh Tasso I am making a new puzzle level if you want Kaizo level puzzle just like not that hard you are here okay awesome not that hard of um of difficulty but you want really like platforming difficulty it's kind of hard but not too tough if you want really tough puzzles then I have a level in the works your level okay it's coming in to try and beat your level. I will try and beat your level. It's been working. It only works for me on my phone. It doesn't seem to work on my regular computer. This is cool. I like this guy over to my right. He's just like, he's having a ball. Look at that expression on his face. He's like, oh, get me off of this thing. But he's just, I guess I'll help him out. There you go, man. Oh no, he's dead. Poor guy. I was really trying to do him a favor. Yes, all right, here's one thing you have to account for. Like, see this spring? I'm gonna take it everywhere with me. I know I hate springs. Everyone hates springs. Oh dang it. But I'm gonna bring it with me. Why would you put a hammer bro so early in the Oh, sweet. Payback! Get out of here, dude. Super Mario Galaxy DLC. Oh, you know what? Somebody did make a Super Mario Galaxy level. It's really creative. Where it's like, so you go in a pipe, and then everything will be like upside down of what you saw before. So it's kind of like gravity reversing. It's really creative. Skype looks like it's down, but yeah, yeah. Oh jeez, a giant sledge bro. I feel like sledge bros are much less terrifying. If you want to take a hammer bro, which is just about the most terrifying thing in the Mario universe, and you want to make it less terrifying, then just make it a sledge bro. It's bigger, it's easier to deal with, it doesn't throw as many hammers. Wow, is this really the end of the level? There needs to be a P-switch back. 
I don't understand this message. What the heck is going on? What is this guy talking about? Whatever. Let's just, uh, wind up. Yes, there we go. Time to cheat. Oh, man. What? Wait a minute. Is that what this guy's talking about? Since I picked up the coin, I can't get out anymore? I don't think we can be- Jolly! What's up, Jolly? Welcome to the stream. I can jump really high. I don't need the spring anymore. There's no use to it. <sighs> yeah, the poor guy. We really tried to help him out. But you feel like it's kind of simple. Well, where the heck is our peak switch? How do we get out? Can I go through that pipe? Maybe I can go through the pipe. Let's try and go through the pipe. Let's charge up the pee! Yes! Yes! Oh, man. Whoa. Is this gonna spell something out like, You cheater. Oh, it says ratness. Oh, and here's it. Alright. No! Why does he move so fast? Jeez, thank goodness I run so fast. Okay, what's up here? Any secrets? There's really nothing? Oh-ho! Is this my- What on earth have you created up here? I've lost, like, everything trying to find the thing. Not a good log! What's up, man? Welcome to the stream. Good thing I brought the spring with me so I can get out. Wait a minute. I think I'm trapped. Oh, well. I killed myself mostly on purpose. The door... It's just a bonus area. What the heck are we supposed to do then? I'm completely lost. We might need this for later on. Let's try and just, all right, let's try and not kill this guy. Dang it, why do you keep dying? This guy's so insistent upon it. I really don't want him to die, but I guess he's got his wishes. He had a lot to live for. You were living a life on a roller coaster and everything. What is up, Madikin? I hope you're doing well. There we go. Wait a minute, there's question marks down here. Rack. Oh, are you kidding me? No! Oh, the, the slam from the sledge, bro. That is pretty obnoxious. Yeah. Okay, so what the heck are you supposed to do? Tommy in disguise. He's hiding. I am doing great. Thank you for asking. I am doing really well. It's a sumo bro. Are you serious? How do you know all the good names for all these things? I don't know where to go now. You can play my Kaizo levels. I am making a Kaizo level for you, Tasso, and everyone else who I know is skilled, so like Jesse and Rockman and Kodum. I'm working on it. Now it's going to take a long time to actually finish. Because not only am I going to have to build it, but I'm going to have to beat my own level. And I am not going to use... Why? Why do I keep breaking my thing? Oh, there's another... Seriously? Where the heck is the peak switch? Is this a puzzle level in disguise? What about the misplaced sand block? Oh-ho! Dang it. But now we can't get up. Well, this is a trap. There were three leaves and the levels called Uptown. Oh. Oh, this is the misplaced. Oh, dang it. There's nothing useful in there. All right, let's murder these guys. All right, slip this down gently. See, you can set things down gently. A lot of people don't know that, but you actually can. All right, let's get Uptown. Oh, jeez. There's only death in up there. You signed up for a Christian dating site. Well, have fun with that, man. I wish you the best of luck. Finding all... The neat lady. Are you kidding me? You hit a power-up in a place that kills me. I don't know if I should be happy that I found a secret or sad that I got dead. I think I'm both. Alright, we'll be here, Malika. And we're alive. Man, I really like this guy. He's just like, he knows how to live life. He's so carpe diem. He's got wings. He's just like, everyone goes back and forth all day. We just live the same routine day in and day out. But I'm gonna live it, and I'm gonna like it. 
Are you kidding? Wait, I put that on as a hat last time. Why can't I put it on as a hat this time? Are there only certain ones you can wear as a hat? Oh, this? Here's my hat. There. Now I'm stylish. I am not normal Red- I'm not normal Mario. I'm Red Mario with a black hat. Because red is really black. There we go. Alright, kill these guys. You got your fancy wings, but not so fancy when they're on fire! Alright, so there's a hidden key switch here. I actually moved the one up. Because it was- Really? You tried to make it more forgiving? Okay. There we go. Oh, jeez! Okay, we finally got through. See you later, fish waffle! Thank you for being Wait a minute, what the heck is the point of this? How on earth do we get to Uptown? It's your duty. Is your mic the w wrong way around? Why, does it sound off? Can you hear things that you're not supposed to hear? Like, did you hear my keys drop just now? If you did, please let me know. We're not sure why it's so sensitive, but we're trying to fix it, and it's a work in progress. We gotta fly. I don't know how the heck to get up there. I don't know how to beat this level. It's all a bonus. Okay, if you can give me a hint, Ratness, it would be mucho appreciante. Is find the opening. That's all we have to do is find the opening. So let's get to the end and see if we can find the opening. It seems like such an easy level. Okay. I want to put my hat on. I deserve to be stylish. There it is. Are you kidding me? The bullet does not believe in me. You hear my keys drop an hour from now. What does that even mean? You speak in riddles, futile judge. Yeah. Are you kidding? Why? Not again! Someone left a giant Goomba H to where you need to fly. Okay. I will keep... Oh, dang. And a giant Goomba just killed me. My voice does sound different. Really? Should I get a new mic? It sounds different. Is it broken? Maybe I should reinstall Windows. 